There are more active drug shortages in the U.S. than ever before. Pharmacists around the U.S. are sounding the alarm about hundreds of medications that are in short supply. Urgent public health crisis. And believe it or not, those supply chain issues are to blame. China's stated aim is to become the pharmacy to the world. Experts warning about medicines that come in from China. Antibiotics, birth control, cancer drugs. Most of the penicillin in the world is made in China. In five to ten years, we are at risk of losing our generic drug industry. Health resilience is such a profound issue and it affects every family in America and it affects our nation and our nation's security. Medicine that you get from your, your pharmacist is actually, the vast majority of it's come actually comes from China. The building blocks come from China. Most people don't know it, but 90% of our prescriptions filled in America are filled with generics and they account for 15% of the cost. So if we take those 90% of the prescriptions, we are left with nothing. There needs to be a real collaborative effort between India and the U.S. So we see a great opportunity for collaboration between the United States and India to, for the betterment of healthcare. We're trying to restore diversification in our supply chain, really meaning where the building blocks of the medicine come from. We're trying to bring back the uh, building blocks back into the United States and back into India and Europe and Japan and all our other trusted allies. We are launching a very important initiative, the U.S.-India Affordable Medical Partnership, which will have an impact on healthcare outcomes. We're here today to share some of the research that we've uh, published today in a report about the important partnership between the US and, and India with respect to um, the supply of medicines, particularly in the context of um, strengthening the supply chain, the reliability of supply. A QVS report actually is a third party validation of the value that India companies bring into America's healthcare system. They actually account for 50% of the Medicare prescriptions. The report uh, really highlights uh, the contribution the Indian industry makes to U.S. healthcare, especially for affordable medicines. So it's a very logical you know, step for the United States to take, to step out, work with India, build that strong foundation, that construct, and then expand it to all our other trusted allies. Consequence of doing nothing is medicines will not be available, mm -hmm. and it will have an impact on lives of the people. The message to the Congress and uh, the White House is to act now. We really need action today. We can't wait for tomorrow. We need action today. Actually, it's very important for our families, for our children, and, and, and for all Americans.